Assalamualaikum and hi guys. In this video, I'll show you how to display on I2C OLED using Raspberry Pi. This is for the hardware preparation. The connection between this I2C OLED and the Raspberry Pi is quite straightforward. There are four pins that need to connect to the Raspberry Pi. VCC to 3.3V, ground to ground, SDA to SDA, SCL to SCL. Make sure the connection is correct then you can power up the Raspberry Pi. I'm using the latest Raspbian Stretch OS and I just use remote desktop connection on my PC. Please make sure that your Raspberry Pi is connected to the internet and it is recommended to update the OS. Next, we need to enable I2C module in Raspberry Pi. To get the I2C OLED address, we need to install the I2C tools. We need to restart the Raspberry Pi to activate the I2C module. After restart, run this command to check the address for the I2C OLED. So this is the I2C OLED address, hex3c. Next, we need to download I2C OLED library from Adafruit. Then, follow this step to install the library that we download just now. Then, install, go to examples folder. This is the list of example code. There are animate, image, stats, button and shapes. I will run stats example code. This is the output from the stats example code. It displays Raspberry Pi status like IP, CPU, load, memory and disk. Now, we will try to edit this example code to display different text. Press Ctrl and C to terminate the program. Now, open the example code folder. We need to duplicate this code before we edit the file. Then, open the code using Python 2. Scroll down and search for editing text function. Okay, found it. This one, draw.text. This function is to display a text. Let's try to edit it. There are four lines of code that represent four lines of text in OLED. Done edit, let's run the code and see the result. Tada! It works as what we have expected before. So please continue to explore the other examples too. Thank you for watching!